Hello everyone. In this video, uh, we will take a look at all the electronic bits present in the kit. So uh, these are all the electronic bits present. So here we have the three LEDs, the 3mm LED, 4mm LED and the 10mm LED. We have a motor here, we have a connector, we have a LDR that is nothing but photosensitive resistor and we have a buzzer and we have the gear motor and the bulb. So one by one let us go through all of them. So now uh, let us take a look at the LEDs present in the kit. So we have the 3mm LED, the 4mm LED and the 10mm LED. So now how to connect this. So before that what you have to observe is if you see at the terminals one is longer and one is shorter. So the longer one is the positive terminal and the shorter one is the negative terminal and you have to connect only the 3 volt battery as if you connect uh, any other uh, or higher volt battery the LED will not work and it will burn away. Right? So to make this work we have to connect the positive that is the red color wire to the longer terminal and the negative or the black one to the shorter negative terminal of this wire. So let us see. To connect them you can just pull them a little bit away. And you can see that the LED is working. Now here one thing you have to be careful is that if you connect these wires the other way around this will not work. Similarly you can connect the other two LEDs also by seeing which is the longer one and which is the shorter terminal. Only for the uh, 10 mm LED you can use the 9 volt battery but it's always better if you use the 3 volt battery to connect the LEDs. So that was how the connections had to be made but uh, in the kit you have this connector bit which again comes with its own crocodile clips at the end. So here you can connect the red ones together and then you can connect the black alligator clips. Then into this connector bit you can insert the LEDs. It is not working that means where to change the terminals. As I said before, the positive, the longer one has to be connected to the positive terminal. So hence, uh, you can use the connector bit uh, while doing the activities and you can play with the LEDs. Next up, we have the simple DC motor. Now how this works is, in this bit you have again the red wire and the black wire which already come with the alligator clips. So now you can connect these to the battery, the red alligator clips together and the black alligator clips together. And then either you can fit a fan and when I switch it on, it rotates in one direction. Now Observe what happens when I change these terminals. Now I am interchanging the terminals. Now when I switch on, observe the direction in which it rotates. So as you have observed, by changing the terminals, we can change the direction of rotation of this motor. Next we have this buzzer. Again, similar to the other bits, it also has the red and black crocodile clips attached to it. So now let us connect again the red ends, the red crocodile clips and the black crocodile clips. And when I switch it on, You can hear the sound. Now in this you cannot interchange the terminals and make this work. It only works when both positive and negative terminals are connected in that particular manner. So if I connect the black and red 
and the red and black and I switch it on it does not work so now we have the gear motor now to this motor you have to attach the 9 volt battery as a 3 volt battery will not be sufficient for this and if the 9 volt uh, battery uh, which has been given is draining out too fast you can use the Duracell battery which will last longer so now uh, we will go ahead with the connections again you have to attach the red wires using the crocodile clips and black ones and then it will begin rotating the wheel provided which you can attach at the end and you can make it rotate and if you want to increase the length you can add this axle bit to increase the distance and you can play with this and uh, we have this remaining two uh, bits here so this is a bulb now uh, this wires can be connected to either of the terminals unlike the LED and uh, this bulb will glow when connected to a battery unlike LED you can connect the terminals in both directions that is I can connect the positive one on one side and even if I change the terminals the bulb will glow since this is uh, very uh, delicate please use it uh, carefully and we have this LDR which is light sensitive when connected uh, to a bulb with battery the bulb will only glow when this part is exposed to the light and once you cover this part with your hand and when you cover it completely the bulb will stop glowing